Welcome back. It's 5:11 here on this uh, Friday morning. The annual Juneteenth celebrations are put on by the Northcott Neighborhood House, and they have been for 51 years. But this community center is a resource for residents year-round. Well, the rest of the year, Northcott does everything it can to serve the community. Serving the community is Executive Director Tony Kearney's mission, vowing to keep the Northcott Community Center open during the COVID-19 pandemic to make sure people who counted on its services could keep on counting on them. We serve about 12 to 1400 people a month. And that is just the food pantry program that Northcott runs, providing healthy and fresh food for those in need. It doesn't get much fresher than this. A hydroponics lab in the center is actually growing fresh greens and herbs. What we really want to be at the top of the food chart with, oh, with um, cool. helping people get the more fresh stuff. Mm -hmm. That's Elizabeth Coggs, Northcott's Director of Operations. We serve people from all zip codes. And she helps run initiatives like Milwaukee Builds a job training program that helps young people and adults learn on the job skills in the construction trades. About 80% of the young people who've come through our training programs are former felons and they don't recidivate because they come out, they get a job day one. Kearney says through the programs at Northcott, they are not only building a better person, but a better community too. We cannot be isolated and everyone in different silos. We've got to break those silos down and come together to improve everyone's quality of life and solve the problems that confront us on a daily basis. Yeah, well, we've put a link to Northcott Neighborhood House on our website this morning. You can just follow this QR code on your screen, scan that with your phone. It'll take you right to this story, and you'll have the link there to Northcott Neighborhood House for more information, Susan.